Okay. Let's watch this intro again. Almost 65 hours into this game. <laughs> Jesus. set with uh, Yuko's um, with Yuko's affection stuff I think spend a night to just do this again just to be safe. Better to have it ready than, than to not. Cause I don't, I don't know. Yeah, Tara's got plenty of time. I'm not worried about Tara, so I might as well, might, I might as well just kind of make sure I secure this so, so I can get it finished. School trips tomorrow. Hey, 
spend time with Star. Not like not to finish it yet. Alright, wait, Star is track team guy, right? Yeah, I mean it's not done yet. Did I mess up? Oh, okay. Because you can still spend time with Star even, like, even like, a bit near the end or something. It's just the school. It's just the people in your school that you that you lose the uh, that stuff with near the end. Uh, running a little sale today. See if anything catches your eye. Take as long as you need. As long as what are you looking for? What are you looking for? All done here? Be seeing you. Good day. Wonderful. Are you accepting a re Let's hear the results. Come to think of it. Juicy meet at the strip mall. You have a pretty good appetite. <laughs> you even kept up with me. <clears throat> How do you stay so thin, though? <laughs> Looks really are deceiving, aren't they? But that means there are people out there who secretly want to take my title as gourmet king. Eh, maybe. Actually, remember that puny middle-aged guy from the other day? I bet he was an assassin! There's nothing I can do about it right now, but I'll show them soon enough. 
Just you wait. In light of your recent achievements and your courageous appetite, I hereby appoint you to the Gourmet King's Royal Guard. No, maybe that's too much of a burden for you to bear. All right, well. <laughs> Thanks, King. By the way, you're a second year, right? So you're one year below me. It kind of feels like I have a younger brother now. Well, would you want to be my younger brother? You're sure, why not? Not really, no. Sure. You do sort of look like him. No, that's impossible. I knew this would happen. I always get hungry if I think about the past too hard. And I just filled up on that beef bowl, too. Better stay true to form and keep eating, huh? Here's to a healthy appetite courtesy of remembering the past. The old memory rewind. All right, now in reverse. Let's moonwalk. Moonwalk? <laughs> what are you doing? You're my royal guard. You have to join me. Now do as I do. What? Moonwalk into Umiyushi. Wow. Bro really does moonwalk. Does, does he do that in the original? <laughs> My package. Nice. Welcome back. I don't remember. He does do that in the original? <laughs> That's huh? incredible. <laughs> oh no. Yes. Oh, and door? Dude, wait, can multiple can multiple instances of endure stack in a, for a, like for once per once per battle thing or no? Damn. Well, if I if I switch to the other chest piece, then I could swap this out. But at the same time, this is technically better. Cause I got full health. I can give this to somebody else. Would, would, well, I mean, that's a single insta kill attack. You can do endure and enduring. So oh, okay. As long as the other one's on a persona. Um, no. When it comes to endure and survival trick, isn't endure better? Technically, because it covers any attack that would hit, that would kill you. While survival trick is, if it's an insta kill attack, you survive with one as long as it's only insta kill. Okay, so I wish I could give it to Yukari. I want to keep anti win master for him on for now. I could give Endure to Akihiko or Ken. Ken could use it because. I mean, he has a lot of, he has emergency healing. Hmm. What is, um... What is Koromaru's second characteristic requirement? Is it walking him? I've already watched the three of these. The, the, all three of them of the movies. Oh, the brushing, that's what it was. It was the brushing. So he's over here. Okay. What do I do? <laughs> I got a whole day to do, but not night to do nothing. I guess I can sleep. <laughs> I could go into Tartarus. I have to find one enemy uh, on the, the, the hand on the fifth floor. A greedy shadow on the fifth block. Huh. The dating site? I'm already done. The only person that I need to spend time with was Yuko, and and her. I did it twice. Want to do it a third time? 
I, I got, I remember getting three notes for her, him as well. Everybody else is done. I, I don't hang out with, with him. Everybody else is, is set to go. Oh, it does add up? Oh. Um, maybe Yukari, I guess, because uh, you guys are saying Yukari is, is is not. It doesn't re it doesn't reward many uh, many points for the levels. Yuko's is almost done. She just needs like two levels. If I don't get the Maxis out, it'd be sad. <laughs> On the train. Kyoto, huh? That's so oh, cliche. At least three points. Okay. Huh? You're not a fan? I'd say it's a beautiful city to make some good memories in while we're still young. Man, is that really the first thing you think? Hmm. It makes you sound like an old geezer when you say that kind of stuff. It does? <sighs> Thank goodness. She actually made it. Hey, what's that umbrella for? <laughs> In case the roof leaks. That <laughs> should. Ah, I see. So that's the style here in Kyoto, huh? So, which way to the geishas? You think we can ask them to put on a show? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Hope it's not too pricey. Keep dreaming, Junpei. The stone area outside is filled with water. Is this one of those open air hot springs I've heard about? That's the courtyard. Why don't you find out? Right, this is the courtyard. Wanna go out for a walk later, I guess? Sorry, Oji. Where was your old school planning to go for their trip? Probably somewhere cool like another country, I bet. Kyoto's so typical, don't you think? Hmm? Me? A trip. Hmm. Do we even have one? How do you not know? That's an event most people tend to remember. It is? All right, you can all chat later. You're blocking the hallway. Girls, your rooms are that way. Go on and get yourselves unpacked. You heard her. We'll see you later then. Yeah, we'll see you later, dude. Yes, I shall see you later, Yukari-san. Okay, okay, enough of this. I guess you're with us. Junpei, guy's room. Man. <laughs> Man. <laughs> <laughs> Three days. Oh, there's almost here. Hey, everybody's here. Come on in. That's cool. Anything catch your eye? Much appreciate by one of everything. I mean, technically, I could buy a lot more than that, but I 
Maybe I will buy some extras just for the heck of it. Why? Abandosu! Good evening! Is this not amazing? We are here in Kyoto. This is true Japanese aesthetic. Simple but elegant. Oh, just look at this pagoda. My, my. How does it stand with only matchsticks? Behold, the wonders of Japan. <laughs> well, look who we have here. Is the Kyoto cuisine to your liking? Honestly speaking, I have little interest in the plant-based fare they have going on here. I sampled the food the souvenir shop had to offer, but I find myself unimpressed. I'll buy some Come more on, anything. I'll call him buy a few more. Uh, no, I'll buy all of them then. Much appreciated. Sure. Turn to my room. Okay. Hey, what's up? I don't know. Uh huh. <laughs> I tried my hand at sneaking out, but still got caught. Well, guess we gotta head to our room now. Come on, let's hustle. Or else Miss Toriyumi might get pissed at us. Hey there. Yo, what's up? Check this out. The hot springs over there, right? Now, if you consider how the garden is fenced. Oh no. You seriously trying to peep? You do know you can get arrested for that, right? Of course not. I'm not stupid. Just imagine the steamy paradise beyond the garden fence. Close your eyes and focus. Uh. Then you'll see everything inside your mind. Give it up, you idiot. No way you can see a damn thing like that. Give up? Never. <laughs> Nothing is impossible. And you call yourself an athlete? Where's your spirit? You're the only one holding yourself back. You gotta push your limits to succeed. <laughs> Never thought I'd see the day you'd teach me something about sportsmanship. You're right. I'm not gonna give up. I'll never give up. Oh my god, these two. Tweedle D and Tweedle Dumb. Hey, Shell, how you doing? Let's go find the, uh... Hey. V6. <laughs> Jumbo juice. <laughs> Durian soda. Can I, like, go in here? I could. Fake sick and relax here instead. Hello. Are you on patrol as well? Just kidding. I plan on enjoying myself on this trip. I only hope there won't be any trouble while. Hey there, Odagiri kun. Have you tried these complimentary snacks? Ah, they're so tasty. No, I haven't had the chance. To... There's nothing left. <laughs> Aren't those snacks supposed to be limited to one per person? Oh, really? Oops. I ate them all. Sorry. I figured. I'll just pretend there weren't any in the first place. <laughs> Honestly, staying at an inn like this doesn't feel much different from our everyday dorm life. I think I'll just head to bed. Hopefully my run tomorrow proves to be more exciting. Even though we were just on a train the whole day, I'm feeling pretty tired. But you know what? 
I've been totally psyched for this trip. I want to sample the local food, hit the hot springs, shop for souvenirs. Oh, and I'm a pro at pillow fights. I sling them so fast, they'll never see it coming. Then, after lights out, we girls get together and gush about who we like. And this year, I've got a lot to say. Oh, oh, by the way, have you checked out this vending machine? You don't really see these drinks back home. Maybe I should buy some as a souvenir. Okay, there's a top bar. Any more up here? I'm gonna buy more. And I check every room. Oh, it's you. If you want to know more about the trip, you can find the details in the itinerary over there. Hey, Fox, how are you doing? <coughs> Excuse me. Almost done. I can't sleep with a pillow that isn't mine. What the hell? Alright, well. Never help you sleep at night, I guess. Refreshes every day. Oh, no. Oh my god, I had him by his scar. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, Annex. We should probably head back. We don't want to miss curfew. <clears throat> Excuse me. Not to mention, Shijo Street will be crawling with drunks and couples the longer we stay. Whoa. Why are you so concerned about me? It was our fight that brought us together, and now that fight is over. We have no common goal, no enemy to defeat. You have no reason to associate with me anymore. You don't have to be hurtful about this. We've reached our conclusion. Why should we keep fighting? Everything I believed in was a lie. And in the end, I... 
You what? You couldn't protect someone important to you? Is that what you're trying to say? You said you wanted to atone for the Kirijo group's past, but that's not true. You were really only fighting to protect your father. That's right. I fought to protect him, and look what happened. I was blinded by my trust for Ikutsuki and fell right into his trap. There was nothing I could do. My father bore the burden of responsibility entirely on his own. And ever since that incident, he looked like he was dead inside. I fought so he could be free of the shame and guilt weighing down on him. <sighs> but it was all pointless. I never should have gotten involved. Am I wrong? <laughs> Sorry, but we don't know that for sure yet. <sighs> You know, I used to live around here. After my dad died, my mom spent all her time throwing herself at random men. I couldn't stand seeing that side of her. So I used to come out here to the riverbank to get away. <laughs> at that point, believing in my dad was all I had. Your father only did what he thought was best. He was involved in dangerous work, but... In the end, he fought to make things right. He believed the shadows needed to be stopped, even if it meant losing his life. That's why I choose to fight. I'm going to destroy the Dark Hour and finish what my dad started. Finish what he started. That's all I can do. That we can do. Right, Mitsuru-senpai? Takeba. You're right. It's not over just yet. We're going to see this through to the end, for my father's sake, and for yours. Senpai. Yukari. Let's face what comes next together, okay? Of course. All right, <laughs> let's head on back and check out the bath. The bath? Yeah, the outdoor hot spring back at the hotel. It's really nice. Now that everything's out in the open, we have nothing left to hide. Nothing? <sighs> well, now, this is awkward. <laughs> hey, stop blushing. You're making this awkward for both of us. Come on, let's get going. It's already past curfew. You don't need to worry, Father. I'm not alone. And I won't turn back anymore. Holy. That's cool. Are they gonna be talking about more crap? Oh, hey! You already changed hey. into your Yukata? Damn, you're fast. Dude, you won't believe what Miyamoto did today. Help me talk some sense into him. <sighs> and do you always have to wear that stupid jersey? <laughs> of course I do. <laughs> this way, I'm ready to run wherever, whenever. Duh. That's the problem! You literally just run off! You have no idea how exhausted I am because of you! Do you know what this guy did? He went on a mad dash up the hill at Kiyomizu Dera. The rest of our group had to chug along to try and keep up with him. Look, man, if you see an incline, you gotta run uphill. That's what a real athlete does, right? Eh, 
Looks like you're still wet behind the ears. Listen closely, all right? No gourmet worth their salt will be caught wearing a yukata. Wheat! Our belly expands, the sash gets too tight, so we loosen it. Then we eat some more, we loosen the sash more, the sash falls off, we're left in the nude. You follow me? No. Ha! Ah, you are wearing a yukata. I also wish to try wearing one, but uh, it was très difficile. Very challenging. The string, it got tangled up and, uh, and my clothes came off. But you look fabulous. I am envious. I wanted to feel like the evil magistrate. You know, the kind who says things like, Oh, ho, 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 I am quite villainous on the tele... <clears throat> on the TV. Come on in, anything... Much appreciated. I didn't even notice that the uh, the menu also changes to him when you thought it as well. That's cool. <clears throat> Much appreciated. It's a really nice touch, man. Also, we literally just started today's stream. We're not. We're 30 minutes in, and that scene with Mitsuru already had me fucking crying. <laughs> I gotta check every room. <clears throat> These two. Here we go. Oh, hey. I must say, the tour today wore me out. I was looking forward to going sightseeing around this historical city, but... Yeah, it was one thing after another today. Some of the older ladies in our tour group passed out right in front of us. I'm glad you were there, Keisuke. Thanks to you, the situation wasn't nearly as bad as it could have been. Nevertheless, it was a shocking turn of events. Yeah, even the tour guide passed out. The way you took charge and directed traffic was really impressive, though, Otagiri-kun. Have you ever considered becoming a police officer in the future? Huh? No, I hadn't given it any thought before. Oh, let's head to the hot springs. I'm covered in sweat after that whole ordeal. It seems like Mitsuru's overcome her pain. I don't know what happened, but I'm relieved to see that she's feeling better. Looking good. It's a different look than usual. Maybe I should go get changed too. Chan and Kirijo senpai together earlier. They looked like they were having fun chatting with each other. You don't see that very often. Just now, I saw Yukari san and Mitsuru san leave the vicinity together.
back to the second floor. We check the rooms here, and then we go to sleep. going on here hey there sure I uh, guess thanks it is <clears throat> I didn't know you could come all the way down here. Going on trips is great, huh? I've seen a lot of the sights here now, and everything is so fascinating. There's so much I've never seen before. My mind's having trouble keeping up. I even bought myself a souvenir. Look, it's a music box. Doesn't it sound nice? I don't know the name of the song, though. <laughs> I'm kind of glad to hear you say that. Sometime, way down the line, I'll listen to this melody. And when I do, I'll think back fondly on this trip. Mm. Evening sun is so bright, reflecting off the water's surface. It's different from the view we get from the school roof. <clears throat> I wonder if this is the reason why people come to visit. But did you know, a long time ago, this place used to be an execution site. Well, that teacher with the helmet, um, Mr. Ono, he was talking about it. He said there are numerous records of historical figures being publicly executed here. I've heard rivers have long been thought to be a border between this world and the afterlife. But with so many couples around, it doesn't really give that impression, huh? You know... I've been thinking, every one of us will die someday, right? Eventually, the time will come when we have to part. So then, why? Why do people try so hard to connect with each other? I'm not just talking about romance either. It's the same for friends, family, everyone. For each person you connect with, it just makes saying goodbye that much harder. So, what's the point? So you mean, you can't escape it? But from what I can tell, everyone around here wants to have that kind of relationship. If they were just forced together by circumstances, I don't think they'd look so happy. Mm -hmm. Oops, sorry. Conversation got a bit heavy there. Looking out at the river just made me think about things for some reason. If you follow the flow of water, you'll eventually reach the ocean, right? Its destination is already decided, but it takes so many different forms before it gets there. Sometimes it's quiet and calm, other times it's choppy rapids. Sometimes it's clear, but other times murky. I imagine we're the same way. We're all in the midst of a long journey, with all kinds of things happening as we go along. I never realized any of this until coming on this trip with you. Everything feels that much more fascinating when you're here. I guess you could say, 
It expands my horizons. Time spent talking together with you like this just feels precious to me. <laughs> it kind of sounds like I'm confessing my love or something, huh? <sighs> the wind is chilly out here by the water. But we should probably head back. I don't want to get in the way of all the couples. to eat next. So far I've had Senbei, Namayatsuhashi, more Namayatsuhashi, Senmaizuke, then more Namayatsuhashi, Senbei again, and Senbei again. <laughs> now what? Ah, yes! One thousand slices! Hmm, that's quite a lot, isn't it? Still, I shall attempt the thousand pickle challenge! Too much of a good thing can be a bad thing. And that goes for Kyoto's healthy cuisine, too. Now that's <sighs> deep. I... Today I saw Kiyomizu. Kiyomizu was so high up. And then I saw Kinkaku. Kinkaku was so shiny. Tomorrow, I will go see Kinkaku. Kinkaku versus Kinkaku. Who will be the winner? What? This is the first time I have seen a bathtub this large. Although, it seems highly inefficient to leave the hot water running. <laughs> That's already the last night of our trip. All we ever did was visit the temples, but I think I'm gonna miss it here once we get home. There's just one thing I regret. Oh boy. Where is the girl of my dreams? Aren't romantic encounters supposed to happen on school trips? That's all you ever talk about. Isn't it about time you grow up? Wow, look at you all high and mighty. <laughs> Even though you're the one sneaking glances at Takebasan and her yukata. What? I, I wasn't looking at her. <laughs> of course not. Ah. Uh. Lord help me. Junpei was looking for you downstairs. Yeah, I know. Annoying my roommates. Alright, let's see. Privacy? Sorry. Yeah, my bad. <clears throat> I got lost. to see any tears in my pants at all maybe that was a bit much <laughs> the kamagawa river has a nice ambiance huh you see odagiri kun was trying to skip rocks across its surface but he lost his footing and can we please drop the topic besides i'd say you're partially at fault for challenging me to hit the opposite bank case gay oh don't you want to see if it's possible the wind was blowing in the perfect direction and all what's the point in doing that because it make me happy but i'm asking what good would come out of doing all that mm. it was still pointless don't you remember our elementary school days we used to practice skipping rocks all the time yes but we're in high school now you're a third year for crying out loud looked like you were going all out though to the point where you slipped and fell <laughs> again can we please change the subject <laughs> oh you're so scary odagiri kun <laughs> Uh, yeah, they really are couple coded. <laughs> Very funny. Oh hey! Oh, this trip went by in a blur. I can't believe we're already heading home tomorrow. Both, both of them, both of them, and then the and then uh. I don't really care much for temples. Yamoto and. But I still had a lot of fun. Let's hang out after we get back. Uh, what's his name? <laughs> I can't remember his name. Magician Arcana. Both of them are also like the same thing too. 
Not as much, but there's some moments. <laughs> oh, Puka. I'm glad that Kirijo Senpai seems to be feeling better. Me too. Anything in here? Just checking all the places. Empty again. Don't mind me. <laughs> Gotta make sure I check everything. <laughs> I like that I like that the the NPCs that are in like these rooms and everything actually have like just one story that actually keeps going throughout the entire trip. Like they don't just like like she's that the NPC I just talked to wasn't like talking about her makeup on the first day and then talked about something entirely different. And it's just she's been trying to make sure the entire time that no one sees her without her makeup on. <laughs> I like that they kept that going the whole time. My friends and I are really into the dessert they serve at the cafe there. Oh, do you want to come with us after school sometime, Mitsuru Senpai? Yes, of course. I'd like to try this special strawberry parfait you mentioned. Okay, cool. Oh, shit. It's a date then. If you have any other recommendations, I'd love to hear them, Yukari. Oh, there's this new place one city over. <laughs> One last check. Alright. Definitely out of stock. I definitely purchased all of the drinks from the from both vending machines here. I definitely just bought out this entire hotel stock. Apparently. <laughs> or limit three per customer or something. I don't know. Whatever it was. Alright. <clears throat> Give me everything. Save the game. Oh, that's right. I have to go downstairs. Forgot. I'm like completely fucking ignored. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> What's up? Want to check out the outdoor hot spring? Ah. Uh, yeah. Come on. Let's go. Sweet. I'll grab Sonata San and Ryoji so you can head back to the room and get ready. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna die tonight. What? Now I have to go back to my dang room. <sighs> Do you know this hot spring is open for guys at certain times and girls at others? No way, really? So, there's a chance it could switch to girls only while we're still in here. But even if that happens, it wouldn't be on us, right? That's true. Something like that actually happening wouldn't be our fault. Don't you think? This might blow up in our faces. Blow up how? Even still, can't help but think maybe fate wants us to be here. Anyway, I was just asking. Not like I'm being serious. Hey, mm. isn't it getting kind of hot in here? <laughs> so, what time does this hot spring change from guys only to girls only, Junpei? <sighs> oh, I'm not sure. No. I didn't bother to check. Right, Yoji-kun? Right. It could happen at any moment, couldn't it, Junpei-kun? You morons. So that's why we came at such a strange time. <laughs> Calm down, man. We're just joking. I mean, yeah, we are here at a weird hour. But don't worry about it. I doubt any girls will come out here this late. How long has this been going on? Not very long. What? It was very Someone's quick. Here. Very sudden. Oh, man. What are we gonna do? Probably just another guy. 
We're dead, boys. Yeah, don't worry. We can say we didn't know. That We're it's dead. all just a misunderstanding. <sighs> wow. This hot spring is huge. No. <laughs> Music. <laughs> So this is an outdoor oh hot spring. Unfortunately, its therapeutic benefits have no effect on me. Shit, it's them! What are they doing here this late? Oh, yes! No. yukari -san and luka -san. <sighs> This is my lucky little... Shut the hell up. Shut up! <laughs> still hear you! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> What's wrong, Yukari? Did you hear something? Michiru's here too? Oh man. There's no way she'll see this as just a misunderstanding. Uh, you don't think she'd get us expelled for this, right? Like, it was guys only when we got here. It's not like we planned this. We were just goofing around. Do you expect her to buy that? No, if she finds us, then... What? <laughs> we'll be executed. <laughs> uh, executed? Yeah, I think I did hear something. Oh, uh, Luca, no. could you check over there? It could be a ghost. Um, okay. <laughs> we have to make our way out of the hot spring without being spotted. What? This is a life or death mission. <laughs> if we fail, calling this an accident isn't gonna cut it. Hmm. I don't see anyone here. What? Luka-san's voice. Is she going around the rock? <laughs> hey, you're leading this operation, aren't you? What the hell should we do? Why me? We'll hide in the steam. Um. Go to the steam, I guess. <laughs> Seems like a bold move, but I trust your judgment. <laughs> wow. We're dead. I really know what you're doing. We're dead, boys. The shadows. No, there's no one here. See, you have nothing to be afraid of. Are you sure? <laughs> the rubber ducky. Looks like we bought ourselves some time. If the wind picks up even a little, we'll totally get spotted. Mitsuru and I guess are probably close too. Can't afford to be careless here. But now what? Use the duck as a red herring. Run for the exit. Use the use the rubber duck. Quick. I get it. We'll distract <laughs> them with noise. Good plan. <laughs> uh, what herring? Why is it red? <laughs> Later. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Yukari, what's wrong? <laughs> Rubber what ducky, happened? time to take one for the team. There was a splash just now. We know where they are now. This is our chance. Oh, hang on. We'll never make it if we just run out into the open like that. Just follow my lead. What do we do? Uh, good point. Yeah, see. What are you, you gonna get some trouble? But you said we can't just stay here, Junpei Kun. What's this? It appears to be a rubber duck. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a toy. But. Still, isn't it kind of weird to find this here? <laughs> it's just a rubber ducky. I detect a presence straight ahead. Oh, we're, we're fucked. <laughs> Wait, this is a misunderstanding. <laughs> he still went to a misunderstanding. Silence. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> we were 
were so close. So close. Okay, everyone. You all remember when we're meeting at Kyoto Station, right? You better make sure you're on time. If any one of you is late, I'm the one who pays the price. We've already paid the price. Well, I'm never gonna forget Kyoto. <laughs> Not like I could, even if I wanted to. <laughs> you weren't kidding about the whole execution thing. Just try to forget about it. Crap, here they come. <laughs> she doesn't even look at him. <laughs> Damn, not even a dirty look. Jesus. This is all Junpei's fault, man. Come on. Man. Welcome back. Hey, man. Honestly, I feel like I'm glad. I, I think I'm glad I failed that. That was really damn funny. <laughs> Why would I want to succeed? <laughs> so dance, if you wanna go ahead, do whatever oh god, I can't. I can't bear to look at my to look at them. <laughs> oh no. Convincing ignore mode. Oh my god. Damn. Jeez. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> hey man. But I gave him a souvenir. Uh, what you want, man? Let me see. Uh, a candy? Thank you very much. Um. Uh, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. That's fine. Boys? That's wrong. That's true. I don't know about that, though. <laughs> I don't remember anything at all. Nope, not a zilch. Um. Oh. Hey, Koromara. Let's go for a walk. Looks like Koromara is really happy to see you. You guys have been gone for a while. You guys must have had a lot of fun on the trip. You've all been talking about it non-stop when we hang out in the lounge. <laughs> Koromaru and I were the only ones left behind at the dorm, so it was really quiet during that time. I can't remember the last time I spent so many nights without hearing a peep. I stayed up late watching TV with Koromaru in the lounge. Then I'd doze off for a while, but it was actually so quiet. I couldn't sleep right. What's the matter? I think there's something he wants to give you, Senpai. <laughs> I feel like I've been able to tell what Koromaru's thinking lately. It's probably because we spent so much time alone together these past few days. Ah, oh, Saturday. Seriously? Career experience week. What? Hey, man. You know what?
What the hell? I don't know if there's more to it because so far it's just a dog with a persona. Fond memories. I need to hang out with Yuko, so Yuko it is. Um, let me go to the tree. Thank you. I'm looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. Here are my wonderful. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Ba -ba -da -ba. Is that true? Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. You have my thanks. Mm -hmm. ba -da -ba -ba. Very well then. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. I think I just gonna buy. Oh, I can buy a lot. Thank you. <laughs> they don't run out of stock. to not try and understand something. Anyways, I decided to start being serious about my future. Remember when I told you about what happened to me at school? It was when I handed in a blank answer sheet for that pop quiz and got yelled at by a coda. Back then, I just wanted to graduate and go to a community college or something. But after coaching those kids, I started to realize something. I enjoy helping people who are willing to give it their all. So I finally figured out what I want to do with my life. Can you guess what it is? <laughs> no 
no idea. Any shotgun? Hmm. Close. You almost got it, Mr. Ex-Assistant Coach. Hmm. I'm thinking of becoming an athletic trainer. It's their job to monitor each athlete's diet and help them plan their training routine. So I'll go to professional school once I graduate and then work towards earning my certification when I turn 20. Between the general education requirements and the classes for my major, it's going to be over 350 hours. That's why I'm going to start studying right now. Improving my writing is my first goal. It took me all night to finish that three-page essay, but those kids had a huge influence on me. I know I only agreed to coach them on a whim, but teaching them really made me think. I started wondering what I could teach my own kids one day, and I realized I didn't have the slightest clue. <laughs> you hadn't been there with me. I don't think I could have stuck it out until the end, and I definitely never would have thought about my future either. So, thanks. Uh, also, I know I'm always asking you to stick around and help me with stuff. I just, I kind of feel bad about it. I'm sorry. I realize now that I might have been relying too much on you. Oh. Why, why are you so nice to me? No. Are you like this? with me no no that can't be it huh no <laughs> yeah of course i sure am lucky to have such a good friend who's so kind and reliable though sometimes you worry me a little <laughs> sometimes you say suggestive things with a straight face you know i get the feeling you might give someone the wrong idea so you should really be careful about that it could land you in some hot water Sorry, this isn't what I wanted to talk about. Um, thank you again for coaching with me. I'm glad I had someone like you to rely on. Next time, I'll be there to support you. If there's anything I can help with, just let me know, okay? We're friends, aren't we? I'm gonna head out. Gotta work on my modern literature and English today. See ya. There's a there's a lot of good uh <clears throat> not good characters in this game. Welcome back. Yeah. Oh god, they're hanging out again. Um huh? Oh my god, I could actually watch the I can actually watch something with Akihiko again. I comprehend. I have a suggestion. I'm worried it may overheat. room really is too small to practice in. <sighs> but come to think of it, I guess I don't have to practice in secret anymore. Although, I don't live on the first floor here, so I might be disturbing the people downstairs. <laughs> hmm. I chose a long weapon so I could match the reach of an adult. But then I learned that long weapons are actually better suited for tall people. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shin again. Jeez, I hope I get taller soon. <laughs> oh yeah, where'd my milk go? The milk. The whole thing. 
<sighs> Maybe I should be drinking more milk. Hmm. It hurts my stomach sometimes, though. <laughs> Drinks more milk. Yes. In this fight, each side had one win and one loss. A serious all or nothing match. And the fact that cool. they were lifelong rivals only helped them push each other to the top. Do you have anyone you'd consider a rival? <laughs> well, good. Make sure you don't lose to them. They must be pretty good if they're on your radar. Kind of makes me want to see how I fare against them. Anyways, you'd have to be really lucky to find a partner like that. All the athletes from the other schools avoid me. So it's tough finding an opponent to spar with. And uh, I don't think a long-time childhood friend is quite the same thing as a rival. But hey, the world is a big place. I'll just keep polishing my skills until I find the right person. <laughs> Sorry, we were supposed to be relaxing, but I just ended up talking the whole time. Let's do this again. I'll put on some real good matches then. I didn't notice the time. Before you go to sleep, you want to crack a raw egg for some protein first? <laughs> sure. What am I drawing? Why is this? What? Ah. What the hell? It's been a while. That voice. Of course we're not dead. I'm glad to see you once again. Uh. Jin, the instruments if you would. Here. Don't tell me you can't even recognize your own evoker. Now there's nothing in the world keeping you here, yes? Takaya. Surely you understand. There is nowhere for you to go. Your only choice is to come with us. You know all too well that death is not to be feared. You need only fear. I know, Takaya. Excellent. It's all his fault. Ever since he started getting too close, I've suffered every single day. And now, I'm afraid to die. Hey, Chidori, hurry it up. <sighs> Medea, let's go. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. It's amazing commodity. I'm going to do it. Not. I just I buy it. Fifty thousand. Thanks, kid. But. I don't have a star. Star persona. Welcome to the Velvet Room. 
Registering it. Will you register it to the compendium? I've completed registration. This is your progress so far. At least both Neko so Shogun and Angel uh, or something strength. are cheap, so I can always just swap back and forth between them. We look I'm not too worried about, about saying that that's paying up that little bit of money. A bit longer. <laughs> Hello? Sorry, but I don't think I can make it today. I just feel bad since I'm the one who wanted to hang out. But actually, my mom fainted. I'm at the hospital right now. They said it's exhaustion since she works from morning till night. Damn it! It's all my fault. And my mom, she's trying to leave. She says we can't afford the medical bills. God damn it! Why can't I do anything? I'm useless. I'm just another one of her problems. <sighs> I'm sorry about all that. I... I don't want to be a problem for you two. But I'm glad you were the one to hear me out. Talking about this kind of helped. I gotta get back to a room, so let's talk later, okay? Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Labor Day. <laughs> Bummer. What's up, dude? All right, let's go. Hmm. Kenshin. Uh. I guess I'll hang out with the monk. Wait, I don't have my uh Well I kinda don't need it. I kinda don't. But I kinda wanna go get Elegor anyway. <laughs> I don't care. Whatever. I really don't want to get rid of all these other personas <laughs> that are expensive. <laughs> Even though this is technically adding up. But again, I don't care. I'm gonna get money back anyway. I almost don't have anything to do at night. So, uh, who knows? Maybe I'll spend forever Welcome in Taurus. Please take a look. Oh. Okay. So you'll be summoning the day. I'm I'm just yours. like throwing up personas like it's Are enough. You <laughs> just I wanna summon this we one and then put litter in its place. I want another one, please. Just rinse and repeat that over and over. Yuko's is almost complete, which is nice. But I'm, I'm not really, I'm not cycling between, uh, I'm not using, the, I'm not like getting rid of those personas because I think those are kind of stronger ones. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. I'm not getting 
to Siegfried. I didn't get that got distracted for a second. Anything I want right now? Uh no. Don't tell me you've attained enlightenment at your age. <laughs> Back when I was a young man, I never had enough money to buy the things I wanted. When you get to be my age, well, try thinking about it this way. You work to make money so you can have a better life. But to make enough money, you gotta work all the time. So you never get to enjoy that better life you're working so hard to have. Quite a paradox, isn't it? Do you know what the average lifetime income of a white-collar worker is? Including a retirement fund and an annual pension. It's 250 million yen. That's not even close to a lottery jackpot. Thanks to me, you learned something new today, eh, kid? Now, don't waste your life working all the time trying to get rich. Just take life as it comes. I could buy back all the time I lost. 